Okay. Cool. So the next question that we got today is, what direction does the Earth rotate? Okay, so let's actually uh, draw out the Earth. All right. It's my uh, favorite planet. I've been there once or twice. Actually, just once, but I've never left. But maybe one day. So suppose that we have the equator here. And maybe if we try to draw some countries or some continents, like we have like Africa down here, uh, Madagascar, uh, here, Italy, boom, like some of those on the Greek islands, and then uh, that's like the Mediterranean, and then uh, up here. Then we have like our countries up there, and then we have like you know our British Islands here. It's kind of like a uh, yeah, and then maybe over here we can uh, try to draw like uh, just be like Gulf of Mexico, and then uh, have a bunch of islands over here on the American, I mean the Canadian. Uh, Atlantic area and then it would be like Hudson's Bay and Quebec's a little taller like that and then but you know you know how it goes and then uh, you know the earth is this crazy place and the way that it rotates is it, it rotates um, this is the axis of rotation this is up with um, right hand rule okay so um, if you're not familiar with the right hand rule especially for spinning things it's like your fingers go in the same direction as a spin so in this case if we're looking at the top of the globe it's going counterclockwise um, the direction that your fingers curl in are going to follow the spin and your thumb is going to tell you the direction of of the axis of rotation so it's going to be up in this case um, another nice thing um, that we can think about when we are um, or a nice thing that you can remember when you're trying to think of which way the earth spins is um, you know if you ever looked on a map and you see China kind of looks like uh, this like it kind of has like a chicken type shape right it's like a, like this kind of like a chicken this would be China imagine the chicken walking forward okay so China would be like over here somewhere and well China's shape is kind of like this kind of chicken like so you can just imagine that the chicken is walking forward that's the direction that the earth is spinning um, Another way that you can kind of remember that is, um, you know, the United States over here, if you're um, more, more on this side of the world and more familiar with this geography. You can kind of see it like, you know, Maine is like the head of a turtle. And, you know, it's like, this is like the turtle's arm or the turtle's leg. And the turtle is like crawling forward. That could be like another way to think about it. Just think about animals and countries that kind of look like animals in terms of the shape of their political borders. Uh, yeah. So, yeah, that's cool. It rotates um, counterclockwise when viewed from the top. Uh, right hand rule pokes you in the face. The China, shaped as a chicken, walks forward. Uh, United States looks kind of like a turtle. Um, that's walking forward. Um, uh, Japan is known as the sunrise land in their local languages and that's because they're the first to see the sunrise so you can also see like you know they're rotating towards the Sun um, that could be another way there are plenty of different ways to memorize this but uh, my favorite is with the animals okay cool so yeah the above solution is good is good uh, many other ways to help remember the direction of rotation as well. Cool.